Hello everyone and welcome back to Fortnite event. So if you want a train that actually can work in survival mode, not only the custom mode, and literally you can go from anywhere on the map to the other direction, you can literally make as much as you can from these trains around your village just to go traveling faster maybe from your village to the snow area or to the, to the desert area. And you can literally go both ways as you can. And now let's start directly on how to build your train. Simply, you will get a ramp from here or stairs like this of course you need to be in the same direction of your village so just make sure you are at the correct position and then after this you will go to here floors and you will choose this one it's rustic fence this is the tallest one okay and make sure make sure while you are building you hold right click to make the snap mode so as you can see holding right click make the snap mode then go left with your keyboard just to make sure it's directly at the end like this then make another one on the other side like this just keep holding right click okay it's really important to hold right click and then while holding right click just make sure you aim your mouse at the end of the wood like this so you can build it like this Now guys, you will do the same thing with the right side, okay? You have to build it just exactly the left side. So I think I'm gonna end it here, exactly. Now we need to build stairs so we can go down. As you can see, okay, I'm, I need to build stairs perfectly match. Okay, let me rotate the stairs and put it here just go all the way to right like this okay now as you can see i'm building the stairs down this is how we're gonna build this now let's do this yeah now as you can see the stairs it's perfectly match and now guys finally after we are over now it's time to build our train so how to do that simply you will go to toys and you will get the dynamic foundation Make sure it's perfectly in the in the center, okay? Just make sure it's perfectly in the center, okay? Like this, like this. As you can see, of course, you move right and left with your keyboard just to make it perfectly in the center, okay? Of course, you can check the downside just in case if you're using, if not, if you are not using BC, in that case, just check your keys and try to make it perfectly in the center like this. Then after this, what we're gonna do is simply uh, using large. Uh, plaster what what is that called okay we're gonna put three i think three should be enough now it's time to build we need to build wheels behind this one we need to put three small wheels okay i'm gonna put one okay okay two gonna put the third one in the center as you can see we built three wheels and that's good now you put the dynamic switch and we start moving as you can see now I am literally moving from this side to the other side but it's not over yet so don't close the video because we need a lot of modification so just wait we need to go to the other side first okay We need a lot of modification just to make sure that this thing is even better, okay? Now we're gonna build another one facing this one, okay? But of course in the opposite direction. Let's make it perfectly balanced again. Like this. This is a perfectly balanced. Then we're gonna build three of these. From the back. Okay. Now we're gonna go down. And we're gonna, of course... We need to add wheels, but we cannot add wheels from the ground like this. So we're gonna build stairs. So yeah, we can see. Now we can simply go to toys, get the small wheels, and let's put three wheels. Okay. And we're gonna put the switch. 
Now it's time to test because these two are gonna hit each other. Okay, I made sure that the, the hitting is slowly. And as you can see, now once we done this, it's a little bit slower because literally they are pushing each other. So what I'm gonna do is just stopping them now and they need to increase the speed. So in order to increase the speed, I will go to here, support, and get this one. I'm gonna put one here and on the other side make sure it's perfectly matches okay then you will go here get the small plaster okay you can put two now let's start it it's a little bit faster but i think we can make it even faster so i'm gonna put uh two more two one here one here just make sure it's perfectly aligned then i will put the plaster I, I normally put the plaster down not up because if i put it up it might not might you know throw me off this uh, train so as you can see now it looks good to be fair so i'm not sure why these got destroyed i think it was a bug or something anyways i'm gonna build these three again and just make it perfectly like the other one, so I'm gonna put more supporters. Small switch here. Okay. Now I understand. Now they are both connected to each other. For some reason, the connection happened. I'm not sure when, but... I think when I did build this, the connection happened between the two uh, vehicles. That's why... That's why it was like one, not two. Okay. Yeah, I see the connection now. I need to make them separate vehicle, not one. So as you can see... Now they are separate. That was literally my mistake. That's why these three got destroyed on the other side. Yeah, because they must be separate. And in order to do this, you need to build the supporters carefully so you don't do the same mistake. That's why I'm, I'm really showing this just in case if you did the same mistake. Some of these blocks that will block the train. If you forgot your switch, and this might happen of course, so just make sure they are at the opposite side at the perfect opposite side just in case okay okay now let's put more because one is not really enough so fully at this yep this will be the perfect train and literally i didn't add more i'm just oh my god this is super cool and as you can see the distance i am traveling is huge Literally.